Hello again, everybody. My name is Schmucky the Clown, and this is Deep Sleep. It's a pixelated point-and-click horror thriller type game. I don't know. I, whatever label you want to put on it, I've heard different things. Uh, I am a big fan of horror, and I know insofar I haven't really done a lot of horror stuff, but it's probably my favorite genre of everything. Games, films, books, whatever. I, just, I love horrors. I love thrillers. I love... That kind of stuff. So I'm very excited to play this game and see what it has to offer. When you look into an abyss, the abyss also looks into you. Fed Frederick Nietzsche, I think is how you pronounce that. He's very German. Sounds like the clock. Point around. Oh, I found something right away. Look at that. The key. Okay, it's one of these. You click the side and you go to a different part of the room. I've just woken up. That's good. Is it just me or does it seem dark for having just woken up? It's locked. I bet you a key opens it. Yeah. What's this? I uh, cube with a key. Okay. So the room melted. Okay. That's good. That's a good st Oh. Why is there a skeleton in my bed? Did I die? Am I seeing the real world? Did I- Oh my god, I ripped off his arm! Why did I just rip off his arm? Can I take the other bones? Do I have to build them somewhere? Apparently not. Nothing under my bed. There's- I can't tell what the landscape is there. Okay. I didn't even explore the rest of that room. I just sort of grabbed things. You gotta click all over the- oh, there's a phone ringing somewhere. Is it in here? What is this? It smells really bad from there. That's good? Stairs? Oh, okay. Here we go. It's a plant. It's dead. It's cold outside. What's that? Oh, I got a flashlight. It has no batteries, so I'm gonna have to find batteries. That's locked. Nothing- nothing in those? Making melodies. Yes, I'm a fucking drummer. All right, enough. Hello. Well, that's fucking haunting. I'm obviously dreaming. Hence the name Deep Sleep. What? It seems to be on a loop. And it's exceptionally creepy. So I appreciate that. Uh, there are big cracks in this wall. Awesome. We'll go downstairs. Uh, it's a lovely hallway. This reminds me of that uh, animated uh, gif on the internet of the guy who looks like a mummy or whatever walking up the stairs and he falls. What's this? I'm sure this note gets to you somehow. At this point, you should know all this is not real. I hope the inner awakening went well and you have a full, lucid control over the dream. Sincerely, yourself. Apparently, I don't have a name. Nothing there. I'm in some kind of weird hotel. Oh, there's a bell. Room service! Room service! Nobody shows up. No shit, Sherlock. Alright, what's this door? This goes down into what the fuck is this? What is that? No, not the flashlight. A piece of old cloth. I don't know what I might need that for. What's this? Oh good, there's a furnace of some kind. I'm just picking up... What? My lucky piece of coal? Why do you have a lucky piece of coal? And how did you distinguish it from all the other lumps of coal that are over here? What's this do? Oh! Well, someone's having a bad day. Not with this inferno inside. Good, you have common sense. Did your lucky piece of coal tell you that was a bad idea? How do I, how do I turn around? I'd like to turn around now. Okay, he's backing up. Awesome. So someone got roasted in there. This is uh, not budging. 
a puddle of water. Can I use something? Can I use my coal with the water? No. Not going to destroy my lucky piece of coal. Human bone, a cube with a keyhole, maybe the cloth? No, I can't use the cloth with it. What if I block it up? I can't block it up. I can't. Oh, I soaked it. All right, so I soaked a piece of wet, or the cloth is not wet. Um, yeah, it is too dark to see anything, isn't it? Cool. So what do I do with this? It needs a lever of some sort. Oh, there's a thing over there. I didn't even see that. Where is that? It needs a lever. So I have to find a lever. Can I use the bone? I can't use the bone. Nope, I can't use the bone. Is he going to jump again? I brought you coal. No, fuck you. What do I do? Why did I take this bone? It looks like it would be a lever. I'm probably just missing it. I don't know what to do with that. I can't see anything in there. There's nothing else in here that I can see. Maybe I have to move that. Because that just goes back. I want to see the monster that was in here. Well, maybe he's a monster now. I'm assuming he was a person before. The flashlight has no batteries. I can't use it. What about the cloth? Can I use the, the cloth somehow with this? No. God damn. There must be... Can I pry the... I thought I could pry this thing. But Yeah, see, I knew it. I knew I could use the bone. Now I can go in here. Ow, oh, the handle's hot as hell. I have a soaking wet piece of cloth. That's right. Hello? Hello? Oh, I found a key. Another key. What is this? What does this do? Oh, I'm chipping away at the wall. Yes. Does that say something? I can barely read it. Maybe I need to find batteries first. And then with my flashlight, I'll be able to read it more clearly. I think it's numbers. Five, three, four. Is that it? Six, five, three, four. Looks like six, five, three, four. That's all I've got here. Okay, I'm going to say six, five, three, four. And so, sure. So what do I do now? Does this open my little cube thingy? No, apparently not. Where was there a place? That's too dark. Where was there a place that I needed a key? Uh, what was in here? No, this was cracks on the wall. This was the phone. Yeah. Yeah, no, I know. Wake up. Yep. I wonder if that's me talking to myself. So, where am I using this key? That's what I need to figure out. I need to figure out where I am using this key. That's some drippy ass water. There's nothing else down here, right? No. Nope. Where is there a key to be used? Actually, wait. Wasn't... Hold on. There was a locked cabinet somewhere. Maybe it was in the first room. Or no, it was in the phone room, I think. One of the cabinets in the room with the phone was locked. Yeah, that one. I have a key. And I got batteries. I got batteries. Now I can use the flashlight, which means now I can go into that really dark room where I'm sure nothing bad will happen. Okay. Uh, this was it, right? Yeah. All right. Flashlight time. Boom. Wake up. Okay. Still horrifying. Nothing of note. Not oh! Okay. Someone's there. 
Someone was there. I like the creepy music in this. Ooh, what's that? A golden statue. Because why the fuck not? I don't want to go where that guy was. We're going to go over here first. What is this? Co something Cody. Little Cody is lost without his plushy tiger. And the horse is old and squeaky. I do not know what the relevance of that is. What could it mean? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. All right, let's go visit Gollum, or whoever the fuck was here. Oh, look at this. Some kind of exit, or too good to be true. What is this? Look at this little sandstone building. It's crawling in the window. What's this? Oh, numbers. Six, five, three, four. I believe that's what the furnace said. Yup. Awesome. So now I'm going to be able to go in here. Seems to be locked. So what do I do? Click. Oh yeah, I click it. Gotta click the thingy. Oh jeez, that is tough to aim. Alright, I got it. It's not fully open. I can fit in there. Come on. Someone's a little overweight. It's almost completely open. Why can't you just go in? Something's going to happen to make me close this door, and I'm not going to be able to do it. Door's already open. Okay. I was totally ignoring it. Flashlight. Thank you. This is just not helping. It's very dark in this tunnel. Ooh, this stuff. Stuff. There's a barrel. There's a door. There's, what is that? A pickaxe. Mine crawl. Oh my god! What the fuck? What the fuck is that? Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit, it's coming for me, it's coming for me. Close the fucking door. Close the fucking door. Holy shit, holy shit, I knew this was gonna be tough. God damn it, god damn it, no, shut, you bitch. Oh. No, I'm not touching that. Holy shit on a stick. I have a pickaxe, you bitch. Fuck me. All right. That was good. That was spooky. Let's get the fuck out of there. What's this? Oh, that must be where I came from. Okay. The per I, I keep thinking it's some kind of first-person perspective, but apparently it's not. So I came from this. I went into here so I can go down the stairs. I can... What? What is that? A hook. What fucking good does that do me? A hook. Okay, cool. What is the, what's the relevance of a hook? Maybe I have to combine more items. No, I got a pickaxe. I don't know what my lucky piece of coal is for. Oh, you know what? I have a pickaxe. This wall up here has cracks in it. That's what this is going to be for. Yeah, this right here, pickaxe. Boosh. Look at that. I feel cold air from the other side. Okay, can I... This is game serious. I'm going to have to do this. Come on. Thank you. Three hits. Apparently the wall was made of coal, too. It just evaporated like it. Oh. Is that a lighthouse? I have a net. I can go fishing. Hello. No, I want to use the flashlight. I want to... Okay. Okay. Fuck the flashlight. That must be where I came from. That little hole looks like where I came from. So let's go to the lighthouse. Because why not? I can only go two directions, it looks like. Alright, that's where I came from. Can I explore in here? No. Can I explore in here? I don't want the hook. Go away. A creepy painting. So at least there's something different on this floor. And the light. Maybe I have to... I'm going to have to turn the lighthouse on. And these must be, like, controls. So maybe I have to turn the lighthouse on and shine the light on something. Maybe I can shine the light on something over here. And it will show me where I have to go next. But that means I'm moving back. No, 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 back. 
back your ass up. So what do I do with these? I don't know what the statue's for. I used the piece of cloth. I still don't know what the cube is for. Maybe the cube has the light in it. I used my pickaxe, so maybe it's just a weapon. I don't know what these things do. Oh, what did I put a net with a hook, so those can combine. I still don't know what the statue is for. No, I, I can switch around how my inventory goes, though, so that's nice. Um... Okay. Maybe I can go back to the sandstone building. Hopefully that monster's not around. Don't go in there. I can't reach there. With this I can. Look at that. Ingenuity! Alright, come on, climb it. You can reach it now, you bitch. Oh, this is the recording! Wait, it was a recording? So it didn't just loop because of the game. It looped because it was an actual recording. What is this? It looks somehow familiar. Looks like someone on a beach. Have you ever been to the beach? So who left the recording? Me? That's a dream, I guess, so it doesn't matter. A golden key. Can that open this? Yes! A shiny gem. What the fuck do I do with the shiny gem? Nothing. I guess nothing. Can I break it? No. Use it with the cloth. My lucky piece of coal! Wait, my coal doesn't go with the cloth? No. God damn it. So I don't know what that is for either. Maybe the gem turns on the lighthouse. I don't know. That's the only thing I can think of at this point. I have no other solution in my brain. Creepy hotel basement thing. Whatever the deal is with that. Uh, this one, right? Yeah, this one. Alright, let's see if this thing... There was that monster at one time. Yeah, look at that! And I can control it, that's what I thought. Let's point it over to where the land is there. It's, no, this way. Out that window. Let's see if it shows me something. Is this just me guessing? I don't know. I oh, oh, there's a bunch of them. They're blocking the way. Yeah, no shit. Oh boy. Okay, I'm gonna go back inside now. Uh, he's following me. Uh, he's following me. That's the creepy bitch from the dark hallway. Oh god, no! Get away! Get away! Blind him! Blind him! Blind him! No, you bitch! No! Get the fuck! Oh! Oh! Fuck! I guess the light doesn't do anything. Oh good, it starts me off right here. That light doesn't do anything? I'm gonna put it... No, put it in the thing. There. See that little motherfucker get me now. Yep, there you are. I see ya. Hi guys. There's a lot of you. No, no, you get the fuck away. You get the... Zap him. Zap him. Zap that bitch. Zap that bitch. No. I said zap him. Zap... Yes! He disintegrated. I was really hoping that was going to work. Otherwise, I was going to take out my pickaxe and just pray. And then just like that, I woke up. The nightmare was over, but my life has changed forever. It was a pretty disturbing nightmare, dude. Was it all just a dream, or were these creatures real? I'm gonna say real. Some Freddy Krueger shit going on there. I have to know. I just have to know the truth. I can't stop thinking about it. I have to go back. Let's go back, then. Back to the deep sleep. Yeah, boy. Deep sleep. I don't know. I know that this is a, a trilogy of games. Oh, see, this one's over. So that's Deep Sleep. I know that it's a, a trilogy. I know that the uh, creator, Script Welder, uh, made Deep Sleep, Deeper Sleep, and Deepest Sleep. I thought the game was going to be longer than that, really. 
That seemed kind of quick. But whatever. I will look up the sequel and we'll carry on from there. Because I, I, this is an interesting little thriller. Could have been longer. Could have had more stuff going on. But it had its share of creepy moments. The first time you heard the wake up on the phone was decently creepy. The first time you saw the monster because it was just eyes coming at you. And it sort of happened out of nowhere. I wasn't even ready for it. Okay, you had to just run away. And then closing that door. Good moment of stress. At the end when it followed you. I thought I was going to have to fight it. I thought I was going to use the light to my advantage to blind him or something, and then I'd have to fight it, but it just went away. So I'm going to look up the sequels, and we'll keep going, because I like these thriller kind of horror games. And this one was interesting. I won't say it left a lot to be desired, because it was, it was interesting, and I had fun figuring the things out. So we'll move on to deeper sleep in the next part.